ma'am from school okay. we only have four minutes yeah that's ma'am just four minutes right so i thought you would not join yeah ma'am actually oh. i forget i just came okay you just came home yeah, so all right so tell me what did you do whole day i mean actually today i, I was giving some classes in school and uh, like uh, it, it was like i was teaching kinna students so i was conversing with them in english and i was enjoying a lot and uh, tomorrow i have to give a speech in school in front of uh, students like in a morning speech so i was also preparing for it right now i'm thinking like how i am going to do it uh, how i am going to do it and i'm preparing a proper speech for that right okay so i hope you remember whatever i have told you yesterday and i hope you are yeah, working on them yeah ma'am that's why i joined a different uh, that's why i like i uh, i was thinking to have another class for uh, with you and unfortunately i lost my chance it is just of 5 minutes but i will uh, i will arrange a second class after uh, maybe tomorrow okay yeah. all right so i hope you started writing your diary yeah ma'am i have started writing diary and even some other tutor also uh, suggested me suggested me a book i am also thinking to buy that book but right now i am not getting enough time so after two or three days when i when I, whenever i will feel free then i will uh, buy those books and i will work on my con uh, english communication also okay see um what are you interested in reading what do you like to read i'm actually nowadays uh, uh, i like to read about like so many stories about like i told you earlier i like so much spirituality so i have read them those books in hindi and i think this is a very popular topic nowadays so i also want to study those topics in english because that is something that is necessary if you want to speak on any topic you must know proper knowledge and that's why i, I read those books in hindi have proper knowledge yeah I, i should have proper knowledge so now it is i'm also reading those books in english so that i can have knowledge and i can speak on in in, in, in english also you can do one thing you can download the app you know pocket fm you will find different types of audio books there yeah. right you can listen to them that way it will improve your listening skills as well you can listen in english and there are some books on spirituality many books you'll find on pocket fm yeah so you can download that app in your mobile and you can start listening to them the english I, novels I as well yeah ma'am i think my listening ability is good and uh, because i have given a lot of time uh, while watching uh, movies etc but when it comes to speaking actually i just started uh, just 4 months ago i started english speaking so it is little bit difficult for me but yeah i am doing it and uh, right now it is i'm uh, trying to speak as much as possible yeah you are doing a great job because see i can see your confidence in you right yeah. that is very important and like i said try to build a relationship with the language yeah. right yeah build a strong relationship with the language if you have passion for the language you will be able to learn faster and you would have that love that zeal to learn the language isn't it yeah ma'am ma'am is it uh, this sentence correct grammatically because somebody told me this is wrong like uh, so that like, i can learn faster is it okay not faster i so that i can learn fast i can learn quickly i can okay? learn quickly fast yeah. faster it's not wrong that is a comparative degree of fast right yeah so, but we say i can learn fast i can learn fast okay i can learn quickly yes. this is also okay yes that's fine i can learn fast i can learn i can be a quick learner okay. right so you may yeah. say i'm a quick learner i'm a quick learner yeah right so try to learn the comparative degree also and when you're speaking in english try to use a lot of adjective words that will take your english level to an idiomatic level try to use idioms also instead of uh, using a very long sentence if you use phrases and idioms you know 
Yeah, you can complete your sentence in just three, four words. Okay. Right? Yeah. Yes. But try to learn to improve your vocabulary. Okay. Yeah. Actually, ma'am, I have learned a lot of vocabulary, but I don't know how to use it. I have completed like uh, three years ago, I, I have done uh, CGL coaching. And that time I, le I learned more than 3000 vocabs. That's how I got interested in, in English. And then I got a job like in a call center also. But uh, I don't, it's really difficult for me to use uh, those vocabs via in, in conversation. See, whenever you learn a new word, whether yeah. you're conversing in English or you're conversing in your native language, Try to yeah. use that word in yeah. your sentence. But yes, you cannot insert any word anywhere, provided it is meaningful, right? Okay. Now, like I said, just learning the meaning of a word is not enough, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. You need to know the synonym, antonym, and also the part of speech of that word, Yeah. right? Try to write a sentence differently using um, the same word, say, for example, pick up the word uh, place, okay? For example, okay. place. Use it as a verb, then use it as a noun, and you will see how it changes the meaning of the sentence. Yeah. Right? Like, like I already told you yesterday also that in English, we only use 5% of functional grammar. Yeah. Isn't it? And try to maintain a medium rate of speed. Do not be too fast. Do not be too slow. Right? Okay. And maintain your fluency without fighting for words, without uh, using fillers, without keeping a dead air, without using too much or giving too much long pauses. Right? Yeah. Say, for example, you need to say something to your students, right? Yeah, you're giving a lecture or something and you're fighting for words. You're using a lot of fillers. Um, uh, and then there was a long pause or a dead air in between. That would be, you know, even people who are listening to you, they will be disinterested in listening to you. Why? Yeah. Because you're taking too long to speak. Yeah. So practice speaking every day like you're doing. You're doing a great job. 